Hi, I'm Jonathan Edwards, and this is Be Still and Know. Let's listen to what God is saying to us today. Deuteronomy chapter 30, verses 11 and 12, and verse 14. Moses said, This command I'm giving you today is not too difficult for you, and it's not beyond your reach. It's not kept in heaven, so distant that you must ask, Who will go up to heaven and bring it down so that we can hear it and obey? No, the message is very close at hand. It's on your lips and in your heart so that you can obey it. We're all sinners, of course, and are very conscious of our failings. So it's very easy for us to feel overwhelmed by the invitation to live for God. Just like Isaiah, we feel utterly unqualified for such a role. But here Moses encourages the people to believe that they could do it. It wasn't too difficult for them. God's commands were not out of reach. They wouldn't need to make a special visit to heaven or cross the seas to discover it. It was immediately available to them. This is a really important message, isn't it? So often people put off the challenge to obey God today because they feel it's too difficult to take on just at the moment. They want to give it a bit more time. Life is rather busy just now, so they think it would be better to wait till the holidays or wait till the children have left home or to retirement or some other distant time. Moses would say to us, act now, don't put it off, don't wait for everything to be perfect. Moses himself tried to wriggle out of obeying the Lord. He was, after all, on the run for many years for murdering an Egyptian. That's why he fled to the desert and was working as a shepherd. He felt spectacularly ill-equipped to do the job that God wanted him to do. He needed to learn that even a murderer with a speech impediment was able to serve God. It wasn't too difficult for him, if only he trusted the Lord. So let me ask you a question. What is it that God is calling you to do for him today? Now let me pray with you. Lord God, thank you that you call us to serve you and that you also enable us to do so. Amen. Well, thanks for listening. I encourage you to join me every day for Be Still and Know here on Premier. The talks are also available on podcast, which you can listen to at any time. And if you'd like to receive a free copy of our magazine, Voice of Hope, which contains all of these devotionals and a great deal more besides, please visit premier.org.uk forward slash voice of hope. God bless you. Do hope you have a really good day.